Hello, thank you so much for joining me today to talk a little bit more about engineering internships with global experiences. To get started, uh, I'll introduce myself. My name is Monica Markley. I am the Regional Enrollment Manager for AIFS and Global Experiences. I work with all Texas Tech students, both in the engineering department and throughout the rest of the colleges of TTU. So happy to answer any and all questions that you have. Today, we'll talk a little bit more about who exactly Global Experiences is, um, why exactly you should think about interning abroad, and how the entire process works between Texas Tech and GE. So to give you a quick snapshot of the organization, we were established in 2001. Uh, we focus a lot on one-on-one -on -one individualized pre-departure programming, as well as the professional development side of things. We work a lot with the Gallup Clifton Strengths Assessment. Um, in terms of the internship itself, if you're accepted into the program, then you are guaranteed an internship in one of your two career fields. And we offer all sorts of uh, support, cultural activities, networking while you're happening, while you're on the program um, in any one of our host cities. We have virtual and in-person options, um, lots of other opportunities post-program in terms of networking, professional development, um, and ambassadorship. So why exactly would you want to intern abroad? First off, um, it's exactly in the name. You get that experience working full time in a foreign country. You're able to expand on those skills that you're building inside the classroom um, in the actual work environment, uh, really put into play all of those intercultural office dynamics and communication skills. And really at the end of the day, it's all about having that experience that you can add on to your resume um, and really have that step forward um, in your preparation for full-time work after you graduate. In terms of what employers are looking for in 2022, uh, they really fall into two main buckets, which would be critical thinking, problem solving analysis, and then all of the soft skills related to people. So people management, communication, coordinating, working with others, making those decisions, negotiating at times. Um, so all of those are really what employers uh, are looking for whenever you're uh, writing your resume, whenever you are speaking with employers during the interview process. Having concrete examples of any of these bullet points will be really helpful in getting you that ultimate dream job. So where exactly can you go when we're talking about engineering internships? The main one that I would highly recommend is our program in San Jose, Costa Rica. Uh, we have lots of different options there in regards to civil, uh, mechanical, environmental, um, really runs the gamut there. If you already have some previous engineering work experience, um, then any of those other countries that I have listed there, Berlin, Dublin, Edinburgh, Galway, Ireland, London, Rome, um, those could all have some potential opportunities for you. Uh, just due to the way that the studies of engineering happen um, in those European locations, oftentimes local students are about a year or two ahead of where US students are in the curriculum. So we wanna make sure that you really have that robust experience to make you um, an attractive candidate to a local employer. In terms of computer science, this is possible in pretty much any of our uh, locations available through GE. So if you have a particular country in mind, um, we could certainly look into that for you. Like I mentioned, um, in terms of the disciplines within engineering, uh, we have placements available in civil, mechanical, electrical, environmental. Um, and in terms of computer science, we have lots of other placements possible for you, including programming, web design, data science, business and marketing, social media, and SEO. Uh, in terms of global experiences as a whole, we have over 40 different career fields. So if you have friends in other majors, um, like you see on the screen, business, creative industries, communications, social impact, um, we have lots of different options for those. So if you have a friend um, in a different major, bring them along. We offer $300 friend referral discounts um, if you refer a friend to GE. 
In terms of the application process and how all of that works, it's basically a two-step process. Um, the first is going to be going through the Texas Tech approval process where you'll meet with an engineering advisor uh, based on the location in which you want to go. Um, Ali Wright works with all of the interns heading to Europe um, and specifically for our programs, Ashley Hasley will be working um, with interns that are heading over to San Jose. You want to submit your Texas Tech application online. The deadlines that you see on the screen are up to date March the 1st for any programs beginning in summer 22 and then April 1st for fall 22 programs. GE works on rolling admissions. So if once you are approved through Texas Tech, I highly recommend um, that you do not delay and wait for those deadlines. Go ahead and start your GE application once you're approved through Texas Tech. Once that's done, then you'll head over to the second phase of the application process where you'll submit your global experience application online through our website. Uh, a couple of things to keep in mind uh, for your resume, it's really helpful that you add any relevant engineering specific coursework, um, as well as your proficiency level in design and math softwares. Uh, like I mentioned earlier, in terms of the competitiveness competitiveness of certain program locations. Um, having third or fourth year level classes under your belt um, is extremely helpful. Once you submit that application, I'll reach out to schedule an admissions call with you, which is about a 30 minute phone call where we'll discuss um, your interests, what exactly you want to do on the internship, background, coursework, all of that good stuff. And then I'll take all of those notes from our conversation to review your application with our placement team in your specific host city. At this stage, we want to just make sure that we are able to uh, guarantee you in an internship and the career fields that you want. Once you're officially accepted into the program and you submit your deposit, um, basically I will connect you with your program advisor who works specifically with all of our interns heading to that specific host city. Um, and we'll get going on the professional development side of things. So that's starting off with polishing up your resume, cover letter, practicing interview responses. And then we'll also have that one-on-one -on -one coaching call with a certified Gallup Clifton Strengths coach. Um, you'll take that assessment beforehand. And it's really insightful and helpful as you build out your resume and practice those interview responses. This graphic here is a nice overview of how the admissions process works. So right at the top here, um, that's when you are officially accepted into the program. Then we'll work on those professional development skills and get you ready for those interviews directly with employers. And then our placement team will start presenting you to potential employers, work on setting up those interviews for you. Um, if things have gone well with that interview, then you are all set. But if it's not the best fit, we'll just continue that interview process. Um, based on all of the communication that we have leading up to that, I would say the vast majority of students have only one interview with one company, and then they are all set um, for their upcoming summer or semester abroad. In terms of the logistics and details, all of our summer 22 programs are eight weeks long. Uh, depending on location, they'll either begin late May, early June. Fall 22 programs are all going to be 12 weeks long, beginning late August, early September, depending on location. Program fees range from about $5,000 up to $11,500. Scholarships and financial aid are available, um, including a $500 discount for all Texas Tech students. Here, in terms of what's actually included in the program fees, uh, of course, your internship placement, the uh, professional development and support that happens prior to departure and all of the one on one coaching that uh, is involved on the ground, um, all of our orientation, housing, 24 seven on site support staff that are available are included, along with some social and cultural activities and medical and travel insurance. As you're building out your budget, some things to keep in mind that are not included are going to be your transportation, meals, personal expenses, and then any visa fees if applicable. If you have any other further questions, you are always welcome to reach me uh, via email. My email address is listed and markley at AIFS.com. You can always follow us uh, on social media on our various platforms. 
Thanks so much and look forward to speaking with you all soon.